All right, guys, so we uh, removed the uh, cage pod for the uh, the rest of the 59 dash. So what I'm going to do is just loosen up these two bolts that are holding up the pods in place. And I already started unscrewing them. So this one comes out, and then like that, the gauges are out. And then now we're just going to put this guy back on. And that way, my brother can have fun with it. Hey guys, going to uh, just see how clean I can get this. Just to see what it does, honestly. No real reason. I think with the steel wool pad? Or did I say too fine? Not yet. So, when Impala came out with this body style, it was because Plymouth came out with the 57 Plymouth Fury. 5758. And their marketing was um, welcome to 1960 because it was so ahead of its time. And it's amazing how much they dump on Chevy in those yeah. videos. Like, they're watching a couple of them on YouTube uh, last week, right? Yeah. And man, I've never seen marketing that aggressive. Yeah, they were uh, they were uh, comparing the 57 Plymouth to the uh, 57 Chevy, uh, which would be the Bel Air. And uh, man, it was a, it was really cool to see how it was kind of like a gloves off type of uh, um, marketing. Yeah, they tested everything, right? The, yeah. the braking, the accelerator. Yeah. It's pretty interesting. So, downhill. Um, I forgot what that that uh, documentary was called. Uh, it was on YouTube, but I don't remember which one it was. We'll find it. Yes, and um, we won't link it, but we'll mention it. Let's see those idiot lights. Wait, I just started shooting the video. <laughs> okay. All right, so he pried it off of the. The last little edge of the screw. <laughs> Just like that. Wow, crazy. Cool. There we go. Look at the back of it. Hmm. You are such lifesaving tools right here. What is it called? Oh shoot, I forgot the actual technical term. But it's a sleeve for the Phillips so it doesn't strip it when you're removing it. Especially with screws that have been sitting for a while. So that's the head. It just goes over it. Oh that's pretty cool. So well, here's one piece. Alright. There we go, one piece. All right, so here goes the transfer of glove box doors or glove box door. <laughs> nice. Hold on, and then one we got, second. Then we had to put the uh, pump piece on there. 
You scratch it, you pay for it. I wonder if that's how it was when they were new and at the dealer. <laughs> Probably. Let's see. Look at that. He got one that looked like that. Oh. Let's see what happens. This one's gonna be the no go. Just about there. Which one's that? Sorry, this one? Just like that, huh? Right. And we need some glue. And then we need Yeah. 